Thank you for visiting this video segment for Dr. Afib. I'm Dr. Morales. Today we're going to be talking about sleep apnea and how sleep apnea can affect a person's atrial fibrillation. So first of all, what is sleep apnea? A sleep apnea is a sleep-related uh, disease where people basically stop breathing while they're sleeping. And during those periods, which can last anywhere from just a few seconds to 15, 30 seconds, patients' oxygen levels also go down during that period when they stop breathing. And people who have sleep apnea you know, they can actually stop breathing many times throughout the night 15 20 50 times it can happen many times where a patient stops breathing overnight sleep apnea is usually diagnosed with a sleep study you usually will go to a facility and have your sleeping uh, monitor with a monitor your sleeping pa your breathing pattern and also your oxygen levels to see if you have sleep apnea so what is the association between sleep apnea and AFib so there have been studies that have looked at this association and it's been shown that people who have sleep apnea are two to four fold more likely to be diagnosed with atrial fibrillation. So there is certainly an association between the two and anybody who's been diagnosed with atrial fibrillation undergoing evaluation for sleep apnea with a sleep study is certainly a very important screening tool for anybody who gets diagnosed with atrial fibrillation. Now we know that there's an association between the two, but does treating sleep apnea also help improve a person's AFib? And the answer to that is yes. There have been studies that have shown that managing sleep apnea can also help improve a person's AFib. There have been studies that have shown that managing sleep apnea using what's called CPAP, where they put a heavy oxygen mask uh, while a patient is breathing to help facilitate their breathing, can improve a person's AFib by about 42% uh, with a significant reduction of, of amount of a person's AFib when the sleep apnea is being properly treated. In addition, patients who have sleep apnea but are being properly treated with the CPAP machine have higher success rates with, with procedures such as cardioversions or ablations and are like, more likely to have better success when their sleep apnea is properly treated. So there's certainly an association between the two, but properly treating sleep apnea with the CPAP machine can make significant improvements for a person's atrial fibrillation. Thank you for visiting this video segment for Dr. AFib. I'll see you next time.